from the workshop today, I basically learned that the RSD is a good tool that I can use when planning my assessment to help me see students' incremental learning and I actually hope that I'll be able to actually design my own rubric for my assessments. I noticed that I can use RSD even for problem-solving uh, cases. So today's session actually gave me a few good pointers and I hope to use those tips that I've learned. What I learned from today's workshop is that the RSD can be used in many ways, in assessment rubrics, in, in planning units, and that's what really excites me and that's the idea that the RSD can be used as a framework to design a unit. So I'm really looking forward to doing that. I've used the RSD framework in constructing assessment marking rubrics for international trade law for the Masters of International Business program. The librarians and learning skill advisors were crucial stakeholders in this project, assisting with continuous suggestions and feedback. Ongoing dialogue has kept the assessment rubric fluid and flexible. I used the RSD framework as part of my teaching innovation strategy in CHE 3163, Sustainable Processing 1 which is the third year chemical engineering unit. I tried to move away from the traditional method of manual calculation by integrating a modern tool to solve the LCA assignment. The RSD framework was a way to map skills required in learning a new software. I used the RSD for my creative writing unit. I mapped the facets to the curriculum and then I adjusted it to cater for more student involvement. I have implemented the RSD informed marking rubric for my unit this semester. Mapping the assessment rubric was difficult, but I had help from the library in Malaysia and Australia. The RSD rubric allows students to develop their research skills. I have collaborated with the library to deliver the Information Research Skills Workshop as part of our tutorials for the first year compulsory unit, Introduction to Management. Students are trained to search for relevant academic materials. Additionally, they are armed with the skills to cite appropriately and techniques to avoid plagiarism. This will support our students to undertake more complex academic tasks in their future semesters and beyond. The library has been helping me in refining the literature search so that I don't have to look through tons of data. So far, the library has been very helpful in holding active seminars which help us as research students to brush up on our writing as well as presentation skills. The library has been very useful to my research. I get updated journal information all the time and because scientific writing requires its own set of skills, I learn a lot from the library workshops doing writings and referencing.